Thank you for watching candlestick trading video. Latest candlestick patterns. New traders spend hours learning how to interpret candlestick chart. They scour a through chart that sh show patterns that formed months or years ago and attempt to learn them all. But when they are trading, it suddenly becomes more difficult to see what patterns is forming right at the right hand edge of the chart. Nothing seems to happen as it does in books. The trick is not to look at the last candle on the chart, but to interpret the candlestick patterns directly preceding the last candle for some insight into what will follow. The fry pan bottom candlestick pattern is a reversal bullish pattern. As the downtrend starts to lose strength, the smaller candles form and as the trend begins curling upwards, it gets stronger indicating a very strong bullish sentiment. That's how the frying pan forms. The cradle candlestick pattern is also a reversal bullish pattern. The cradle is a pattern that is symmetrical and fairly easy to spot. It has long red candles which signify the downtrend. Uh, these are followed by a series of trading days where the traders are undecided where to go. Finally, a strong bullish candle forms which is almost exactly the same size as the final bearish candle which formed on the downtrend. This indicates that the bulls are out in force. The three inside down candlestick pattern is a bearish reversal pattern. The candle shown on the first day of this three day advanced candlestick pattern is a strong bullish candlestick. However, on the second day, the stock falls and the bulls can't bring the stock back and the stock closes down. On the third day, the trend continues lower and closes below the opening of the first day. This shows a strong bearish signal which is confirmed by a strong bearish candlestick on the fourth day. This pattern generally confirms the harami as the second day shows a weakness in the bullish trend and the third and the fourth days confirm this weakness as ongoing. Thank you.